Oh, precision screwdrivers. Except I can't reach them. That was very smart, dumbass. No can reach. Let's see. The tools are stuck, out of reach, and no way in hell to get them. Man, I should have done that before they fell. That was very smart, dumbass. No can reach. Mad skills, Max. I've got the tools. I should go back upstairs before Chloe freaks. Chloe's stepdad is head of security at Blackwell. He wants to put surveillance cameras all over the school? How paranoid can you get? Chloe's stepfather is this asshole from Blackwell? You've got to be shitting me. One of these guns is missing. I hope Chloe's stepdad isn't packing heat.
Doesn't look like the Price family is rolling in dough these days. You found the tools. Sweet. You can sit at my desk and fix your camera. So? I can't fix this thing. Are these your new photos? Yeah, I just took them today. Let me see. Wait, I've seen this before. Uh, no way. When did you take this? You took this photo, you brat? In the bathroom today. You set off the alarm. That's why Nathan raged after you. It totally makes sense. You hella saved my life. Now tell me the truth, Max. I was there, hiding in the corner. Damn, you're a ninja. A ninja would have cut Nathan's head off. I just took a butterfly photo. That is so badass. Oh yeah, I almost wet myself when I saw the gun. So, did you recognize me? Not at all. Your hair and clothes are so different. I hope so. I'm sure this is all so weird to you after coming back. Like you said, it's been that kind of day. So you must have overheard our conversation. Just a bit. There is no way you didn't hear every single vowel. Okay, I only heard something about money, drugs, but that's it. Now for the big question. Did you tell anybody? Like who? Like anybody. Stop stalling, sister. The principal. But he didn't seem to believe me. The principal? Are you still 12? That drunk jackass only cares about cash for Blackwell Academy. Don't trust him. I didn't mention you at all. Swear. Thank God. I'll tell you more someday. And I seriously owe you, Max. No, it was your birthday last month. This was my real father's camera. I want you to have it. That's so cool you remembered my birthday. But I can't take this. Of course you can. My dad would be pissed if I never used it. And now I know it'll be used awesomely. And I'll snag this picture as a symbol of our reunion. Cool? Yes, of course it's cool. Thank you. This camera is so sweet. Now that we got that mushy shit out of the way, I feel like stage diving. Let's thrash this place. You're crazy. Yep, yep, I'm fucking insane in the brain. Let's dance. Shake that phony white ass. Or take my picture with your new camera. Tuesday <laughs> couldn't get any stranger. The song fucking rules. Can't dance, hippie? Come on. Rock out, girl. Yes, break it down, Max. Yo, turn it off. Turn it off. How many times have I told you to stop blasting that punk shit? Dude, the music's not even on. Oh, no fucking way. You need to hide now. My stepdad will kill me if he finds you here. Chloe, 
Chill, I'm changing. Is that okay? Okay. Max, find a place to hide now. Chloe. I'm coming. What are you doing? Chloe, you're stalling. I'm changing. Give me a minute. Don't get smart. Mm -hmm. Just let me in now. Please. One second. My bra oh is stuck. Oh my god. I'm not screwing around, soldier. Yeah, Chloe, open this door. Yeah. I'm giving you exactly three seconds to open the door. One, two, three. Shit. What's going on in here? Why is she here? None of your business. I don't like strangers here. Stop freaking. She's not a stranger. This is my friend. Great. Another one of your friends. One of my guns is missing. Did you take it? Oh, God, I didn't take your stupid gun. You do know I believe in gun control? Wait, is that grass? You been token up again in here? Oh, yeah, guns, weed. You were tripping balls. I'm sick of your disrespect. Tell me the truth. That's an order. It's not my pot. It's from Max. Is this true? No way. That's not mine. Oh, of course not. I'm sure Chloe gets all the best shit, right? I'm sure she gave you good friend rates. Why don't you get off my crack? Stop taking your war rage out on high school girls. You have seen rage, you little... Fuck you, pig! I... <sighs> Listen. You asked for that. You know exactly what you're doing. I can already tell from today that you're trouble, Max. I hope this doesn't affect your status at Blackwell. Don't ever come back here. Listen, dipshit, if you ever lay a hand on me again, I'll have your ass in jail. Then you can guard yourself all night. You're the ones who'll end up in jail. Oh, you only think you're tough and clever. This too shall pass. And clean this pigsty up. I'm sorry, Chloe. I didn't know what to do. Whatever. Everybody bails on me. Even my best friend, Max. Don't you? I'm so done with everybody in this town. I wish I hadn't even seen you. As if you care. Color me out of here. David was such a mean bastard to Chloe. What if I had stepped up to help? I could change this so I don't hurt Chloe. <laughs> I haven't been here in forever, so why do I feel like I was just here? Whoa, this is the exact same path I was on during my nightmare today. Birds are so lucky, they can always escape. Looks like the youth of Arcadia Bay still come up here to party. I never made it. How long has that been here? Sure you don't want to be alone? Sit down if you want. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry I wussed out. No worries. I know my step dwarf can be scary. I'm not as brave as you. And David is indeed a step douche. I'm sorry you had to experience it firsthand. 
You have to live with him. Has he always been this way? Ever since my desperate mom dragged his ass to our home, I never trusted David. I should have taken his photo when he flipped out on Kate today. That would be killer blackmail material. Let's bust his ass. He has some kind of weird agenda. He has a lot of secret files. Rambo still thinks he's gathering enemy intelligence. Did you take a peek? I wish. You know I would have read them. I'd love to. They must be important or he wouldn't hide them deep in his garage bunker. He kind of creeps me out. I bet the truth is out there in his files. Most likely, but it's good you didn't find his files. He would go ballistic. He's a total surveillance fetish. Or are there spy cams in the house? Sometimes ignorance is bliss. No wonder I'm so miserable. Everybody in this town knows everybody's secrets. What's Nathan's secret? He's an elite asshole who sells bad shit cut with laxative. And he dosed me with some drug in his room. What? I met him in some shithole bar that didn't card me. He was too rich for the place and too wasted, and he kept flashing bills. Just tell me what happened, Chloe. Now. I was an idiot. I thought he was so blazed it would be an easy score. You needed money that bad? Actually, yes. I owe big time. And I thought I'd have enough for me and Rachel if she showed up. So, what about you and Nathan? We went to his room at Blackwell. We drank, and I laughed at his rich kid bullshit. He was one step ahead and put something in my beer. God, Chloe, I can't believe this. I mean, I do. Then what? I know I passed out on the floor. I woke up and that perv was smiling, crawling towards me with a camera. Go on. Everything was a blur. I tried to kick him in the balls and broke a lamp. Nathan freaked, so I managed to bum rush the door and get the hell out. <sighs> Max, it was insane. I am so furious, I can't even speak. What did you do then? I figured I would make him pay me to keep quiet. So we met in the bathroom. And he brought a gun. That was Nathan's last mistake. What are you going to do? Pop a cap in his ass? Let's call the police. Screw that. You already told the principal and I'm sure it's useless. I won't always be there to save you. You were here today, Max. You saved me. I'm still tripping on that. Seeing you after all these years feels like destiny. If this is destiny, I hope we can find Rachel. I miss her, Max.